Good morning, friends, and welcome to Wednesday, September 2nd. Thanks to Barb Bigger for getting us started this morning. from the Upper Room Discipline by Willie S. Teague. And our scripture is one, Psalm 149, 5 to 9. Let the faithful exult in glory. Let them sing for joy on their couches. Let the high praises of God be in their throats and two-edged swords in their hands to execute vengeance on the nations and punishment on the peoples to bind their kings with fetters and their nobles with chains of iron, to execute them on the judgment decreed. This is the glory for all his faithful ones. Praise the Lord. The second half of our psalm takes a sharp turn from praising God with a new song and dancing to to executing vengeance and punishment and judgment. Verse tells us to have praise of God in our throats and a two-edged sword in our hands. The vengeance, punishment, and judgment we are to execute are God's, not ours. The phrase translated two-edged sword is literally sword with two mouths. Could that mean that we are to use two words or forms of praise to realize God's ultimate victory over the powers of evil? Perhaps it is praise that remembers God's grace and praise that proclaims the hope of God's continuing grace. Such a sword with two mouths can pierce the human heart as a two-edged sword can pierce the human body. While the first half of the psalm is a call to praise, the second half is a call to action. The psalmist urges us that as we praise God's grace, we also proclaim grace to all who are weary. 
and are carrying a heavy burden. Our prayer today is a guided meditation. So get comfortable, relax, take several deep breaths, and rest between each of these suggestions. Remember when God has been gracious to you. Remember the saints that show you the way of faith. Remember when you have found rest from the weariness of life. How often do you praise God with a loud voice and dance in God's presence? Who in your life needs to hear Jesus' offer of rest? To whom do you need to show the way to faith? And give thanks to God for your sword with two mouths. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. And now thanks to Esther Knopfsinger who will accompany us with I Love to Tell the Story. God in a new way today. Be blessed. Amen.